wingsuit flying absolutely is aviation. And that's why people get into this is because we can move, because we're flying through the air. Since we are actually flying, we need to start looking at this the way pilots look at flying anything else. This is preparing new wingsuit pilots and even experienced wingsuit pilots to fly today's suits and to fly with today's techniques. We're here as wingsuit coaches, but that's the thing. We're not just providing you with wingsuit coaching. There's a whole foundation of skill sets that we want to give to our students that's going to give you a better technical understanding of everything you're doing. Everything is built on a base platform of skills and knowledge, and from there, you're going to keep taking it to the next level, to the next level, to the next level, and really there is no limit to that who you want to be in this sport, in this discipline, where you want to take it, whether it's performance flying, big suits, jumping off a mountain, acro in a small suit, doing a 100-way wingsuit formation that breaks a world record. Wherever your dreams are, that is the next level, but we want to help you get there just one step at a time. The progression that we have will teach you a safe way of, of going step by step through everything and getting to that competent level that you need to be at. And our goal is to provide information. If you're ever feeling like you lack anything, you're in our family, you're in our network, come back to us, and it's just a huge net that will catch you and try and build you up. Coming out to the drop zone, making a bunch of jumps on your own is expensive, and having somebody there who's got a lot of experience and can help you shortcut that learning progression can be extremely valuable. If you come and take a course with Next Level, you will learn what you can in the time that you have. But that's not where it ends, right? Learning is just a continuous process. So you will take with you a skills development plan. It will be a checklist of things that you can do in the air that will help you with your deliberate practice so that you can take all of the concepts that you learned during the course or during the coaching and continue on and carry that with you through your own skydiving. Realistically, you're a glider, a really bad one. <laughs> Right? And energy is, is your best friend. So if you don't have the understanding and, and know how to use the elements that are involved for unpowered flight, you're way behind the power curve. In wingsuiting, we have continued to make the same mistakes, unfortunately. And so it's nice to gather everybody together here, get on the same page, and let's try to eliminate these mistakes and really get everybody's thoughts and ideas so that we move forward in the sport, make it safer, make it f more fun, make it more enjoyable for everybody that does it.